Hello friends, welcome to my channel Technical Arco and myself Arnab Kondu. Today I will discuss another topic what is Simputer. Okay, so if we talk about what is Simputer, so at first we should know what the acronym for this Simputer is concerned. Okay, Simputer acronym is that simple, inexpensive and multilingual people's computer. Okay. This product was developed in our country in India. Okay. It was released in the year 2002. So I will discuss elaborately what is Simputer. Okay. So go to the computer screen. I will discuss elaborately and also I will discuss why Simputer failed. Okay. So go to the computer screen. So friend, today I will discuss the topic Simputer, okay? So at first we should know what is Simputer. The Simputer was a self-contained open hardware Linux based handheld computer first released in 2002, right? Developed in and primarily distributed within India. The product was envisioned as a low cost alternative to personal computers, right? The device was designed by the Simputer Trust, a non-profit organization formed in November 1999 by seven Indian scientists and engineers led by Dr. Swami Manohar, right? The word Simputer is an acronym for simple, inexpensive, and multilingual people's computer and is a trademark of the Simputer Trust. Okay. The Simputer is a low cost portable alternative to PCs by which the benefits of IT can reach the common man. It has a special role in the third world because it ensures that illiteracy is no longer a barrier to handling a computer right the simputer meets all demands through a browser for the information markup language known as iml iml has been created to provide a uniform experience to users and to allow rapid development of solutions on any platform right now we talk the history of Simputer. The Simputer project was conceived during the organization of the Global Village, an international seminar on information technology for developing countries conducted during Bangalore IT.com event in October 1998. Okay. Simputer aims at developing low cost device that can pervade the rural landscape, especially in the third world countries. Okay. The key to bridging the digital device is to have straight devices that permit truly simple and natural user interfaces based on sight, touch and audio. Right. In 2004, computers were used by the government of Karnataka to automate the process of land records procurement. Okay. Simputers were also used in an ambitious project in Chhattisgarh for the purpose of e-education. Okay. In 2005, simputers were used in a variety of applications such as automobile engine, diagnostics, electronic money transfer, track traffic offenders and issue traffic tickets. Right. The device includes text to speech software and runs the Linux operating system. Okay. Similar in appearance to the Palm Pilot class of handheld computers, the touch sensitive screen is operated on with a stylus, simple handwriting recognition software. Okay. It is small, inexpensive handheld computer intended to bring computing power to developing countries right 
It includes text-to-speech software and runs the GNU Linux operating systems. Okay. The device was designed by the Simputer Trust, a non-profit organization formed in November 1999. Okay. Simputers are generally used in environments where computing devices such as PCs cannot be used. Okay. Announced in 1999, the hardware and software specifications were made open source and are part of the non-profit Simputer Trust. Okay. In 2004, a version named the Amida Simputer was introduced to appeal to the retail market. Okay. The Simputer runs on the processor called Intel Strong Arm chip which is known for its low power consumption and Simputer uses the AAA batteries. Right. IML means Information Markup Language. This language has been created to shoot the unique needs of the Simputer. Right. Simputer is however XML based rather than HTML. Okay. This is because IML is XML application and so does follow the internet standards. Okay. The projected cost of the Simputer is about rupees 9000. The smart cut feature that the Simputer provides which enables the Simputer to be shared by the community. Okay. Now you talk about why Simputer failed. The Simputer is just one example of scores of technology projects that failed in the country due to lack of support from the government or the public. Right. It was not just the government. It was hard for Indian customers, whether individual or institutional, to trust a new product from an Indian company. But should remember, this Simputer is made by Indian. Okay. And also it is an Indian product. Right. With initial goals of selling 50,000 Simputers, the project had sold only about 4,000 units by 2005 and has been called a failure by different news sources. Okay. The Simputer could not find a market in India, although it was tailor-made for rural India, right? The union government and state governments saw multiple demonstrations of its capabilities, but never approached Picopeta with an order, right? Some applications where this Simputer are used in the field of micro banking, large data collection, agricultural information, school laboratory, right? I hope you have understood today's topic. Today's topic is Simputer. It feel as proud. Why? Because this product was made in India and also it's made by some Indian. Okay. I hope you have understood today's topic. Keep watching my channel Technical Arquin. Okay. I hope that you have understood today's topic. For more videos, keep watching my channel Technical Arquin. Thank you and bye-bye.